This is KMTV 3 News Now. Good Tuesday, I'm Mary Nelson with 3 News Now, and here's a look at what's happening. Hundreds of workers will be on the picket lines again this morning, but their union and Kellogg's leaders are talking. The union said yesterday's negotiations went to nearly midnight as both sides talked about a different way to help newer workers become fully vetted employees. The strike is now in its seventh week. Union leaders say they offered to meet again the week of December 6th, hoping to get a deal so union members can vote on it. Nebraska and Iowa State troopers are joining forces to help keep people on area highways safe this holiday season. They'll focus on Thanksgiving holiday enforcement efforts along with troopers from Kansas, Missouri and Arkansas. Each agency is taking part in the Click It or Ticket campaign, which runs through this weekend. And on 3 News Now, Chief Meteorologist Mark Stitz. A lot of wind coming out of the south today. That's blowing in warmer weather. Going to help our mostly sunny skies get us to near record warm. Today's record high, 64. I think we'll top out near 62. Overnight, still plenty of wind. And as clouds move in, we keep it pretty warm for a morning this time of year. A low of 44. But cold front then arrives and it will be a cooler day tomorrow. Mostly cloudy, breezy still near 52, but the real cold settles in on Thanksgiving. We start the day at 24, only get to 37 for the afternoon, but at least it'll be mostly sunny, so it'll look nice as you look outside. Friday, still mostly sunny and we get breezy again. That'll warm us up to 54. Mid 50s continue Saturday, even with a small chance of rain, then staying just a little bit above average in those 50s Sunday and Monday.